fought men at your estate. They were waiting to finish what they started. The night my husband and sons rode to face the Mongols. The assassins came to our home. My sister took the children and fled. I stayed with my son's wives to fight our attackers. We were outnumbered. And then I was the only one left. That's how it ended for me at Komoda. For me. It wasn't over. I buried them here. With the rest of our family. I tried to save them, but the assassins caught them on the road. Cut them down. My sister. My grandchildren. Even little Natsu. She was just born. All I could do was bury her with her mother. This never should have happened. My sister should have been buried with her husband in the north. But at least she is with family. Come. We ride for the Golden Temple. Sorry you endured this alone. I am not alone. The killers are alive. They will pay for what they did. Every moment the killers walk free brings me shame. You can't blame yourself. But it is my duty to punish them for it. You'll have to go in without me. Find the monk named Sogen and tell him the fate of Clan Adachi. What are you plotting, Lady Masako? Indulge a grieving widow. Once you've talked to Sogen, find the armorer. She is repairing something for me. I want you to have it. I will do that. Thank you. I will wait for you on the other side of the temple. Lord Sakai, it is an honor. Are you in charge here? I think of myself as more of a servant, my lord. Please, call me Junshin. I made this temple a haven for our people. I'll spread the word. If they cannot make the journey, there are also camps around Ariake. I supply them with all the food I can spare. That's good to know. I'm looking for one of your fellow monks, a man named Sogen. I believe he is sweeping the temple deck. Thank you, Jinxing. Continue your good work. Only so much. Are you Sogen? I am. I am Sakai. A samurai? Alive? I have a message from Lady Masako. Clan Adachi was attacked. She is the only survivor. The Mongols. Traitors. Our own people. How horrible. Has anyone suspicious passed through the temple? A group of armed men? Not that I've seen, but... My duties keep me far too busy. Please tell Lady Masako she's welcome to take refuge here. Thank you for your time. Of course. I need to find the armor. There's a smaller who's trying to save her to and from the issue. I'll do it. There is one. My armor will dull the Mongols' weapons. Lady Masako sent me. Said you were repairing something she wanted me to have. The armor. It's one of the finest sets I've ever worked with. Let me get it.
It suits you perfectly, my lord. The quality is incomparable. It will serve you well, but if anything isn't to your liking, I can always make alterations. All I need are the right materials. Thank you. You got the armor. It fits well. It belonged to my eldest, Shigesato. It is an honor. I spoke to the monk. What did Sogen say? He offers you refuge in the temple. So my family's killers know where to find me. We need to move. You think Sogen is behind the massacre? He visited my home just before the assassins. The little bastard was their scout. That doesn't prove his guilt. No, but it earns my suspicion. Sogen arrived from Kamiagata at the beginning of autumn. When we first heard the Mongols plan to invade. The plot to destroy my clan took precision, planning. And a war to cover the treachery. Where is that monk? There's Sogen, leaving in a hurry. Let's follow the wolf to his den. We can get down here. You sent me to frighten the monk. I knew he would panic, make a mistake. Now he's leading us to his friends. Stay close. We can't be seen. Masako's alive. She has a samurai with her. Hmm. That must be who killed our men at the estate. You fools. Now they know I'm part of this. You have to find them. Keep your voice down. I'm going inside. Don't come back until they're dead. Those men slaughtered my family. Spare the monk. The rest can die. Who will fight? Show me the mighty samurai. Man, Adachi! Ah! <laughs> 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 
There's nowhere to run, Sogan. You destroyed Clan Adachi. I was only a messenger. For who? Knowledge does not end suffering. You know nothing of suffering. Masako. I buried my family, one by one. It took days. But I'm going to leave you for the wolves. We need him alive, to tell us who he serves. Our world has changed. Men of vision must rise to face it. And those in the way must be removed. They were children! <laughs> Masako! He, he was never going to talk. We still need information. There has to be something we can use. Search outside. I'll deal with things in here. Find me when you're done. Payment for slaughtering children is that all their lives were worth. Hmm. Names. And a symbol. Masako might know them. Did you find anything? A list of names and a clan symbol. I found the same symbol on these men. I've never seen it before. A rival clan moving in to take control. We have to stop them. I will. You cannot do it alone. When my uncle hears of this, he will not rest until the traitors pay for what they did. Help me, and we will bring down everyone who hurt you. Together. When you need help rescuing your uncle, I will be there. Thank you, Lady Masako. Until that time, I have work to do. are everywhere. In a fight, they will surround me like wolves. I need to find new methods to keep them at bay. A well 
well-balanced blade I can throw to catch a foe by surprise and finish them off. You found me. You handle that well. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners upriver. They had a blacksmith with them. Your brother? Sounds like it. They were taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place. Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? I found two warriors. Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masako Adachi. You've been busy. Haka can help you. After we save him. Hard to believe I might see him soon. He's lucky to have you. He might disagree. That's what siblings are for. What about you? Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? Take a breath. Because then I'll know there's hope for our island. You feel that strongly? I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are your wounds? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? <laughs> I suppose you're right. 
My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions, like you master a horse or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. There's a spot up ahead that overlooks the river. Should give us a good view of the Mongol camp. There's the camp. Tough to get inside. The Mongols threw that place together in days. There has to be a way in. Let's look. We need to reach Taka without putting him in danger. We'll find a safe approach. We could scale the rocks on that side. If they're loose, they might give way. Alert the guards. Defenses in back are formidable. The front wall there is still under construction. Could be a way in. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Slip inside. And cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, they'll kill the prisoners. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Like thieves. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled by criminals. We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father, who just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing, but we have to fight back. I promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it to save my family and what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look, see what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. Let's move. Taka, he's been through a lot, even before the invasion. But you took care of him. Someone had to. He hated when I stole. If it was that, the star. I didn't have a choice. I didn't choose to be a samurai either. But going against my instincts, my code. It's better than getting wiped out by the Mongols. We have to fight back, any way we can. Through here. If they see us, they'll kill the prisoners. Then we better stay quiet. And open their throats. Jin. The bear's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, uncle. Keep after him. I didn't think bears lived here. They don't. But the fighting in Yarikawa drove some this way. So it's the rebels' fault. We should feed them to this bear as punishment. We are not barbarians, Jin. The 
pair stumbled here. Is it dying? No, but we're getting closer. Stay ready, Jin. Yes, Uncle. If it's still alive, can I take the shot? Prove you can control your emotions. Then, perhaps. We got him! Careful! He could still be alive. This arrow should not have killed him. Look, Uncle. There's a gash in his side. Not from an arrow. From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the Chido in the back! Rosakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you! He must answer for this crime with his life. And look him in the eye. Teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear. And take his life with honor. When we fight, we face our enemy head on. When we take their life, we look them in the eye with courage and respect. This is what makes us samurai. Only cowards strike from the shadows. Jin, what's wrong? Let's find your brother. We can't let them see us. Use all your senses. Think and move like a thief. 